Okay, so here is the AI hollow box that I uh, ordered and I am located in uh, Las Vegas and um, and, it, and it took a little bit of time. Uh, it was, really wasn't too much of a price for it, but it is my true opinion uh, working with this and also working with the, with the, uh, uh, the person, I guess, um, that, that we bought it through. So I bought it through an online thing called Indiegogo or something like that. Uh, Kickstarter style and then um, I waited and waited and then I had a lot of issues with them I said hey let me have my money back I just don't want it after all I'm not, I, you know, I had some bigger plans with it but uh, it just wasn't going to be there but I tried contacting them again and I uh, went through Indiegogo and uh, Kickstarter they said oh no they already had uh, shipped your account so we, therefore we can't give your money back anymore and a lot of people experienced this so they kind of played dirty with us um, uh, they really did and i'm just going to say it exactly what i went through i'm not going to make anything up in my full experience and uh so i went to them and said hey you you guys they, they said you had uh, provided and closed the account that the product is already on its way and you telling me you haven't even shipped it yet which sounds like illegal fraud basically and then they uh, uh they said no no we, you know we haven't shipped it yet and you know he would give me every excuse in the world to for me not to refund the money, I guess. And um, I said, you know what, I, it's only a couple hundred bucks, whatever, so I decided to wait. One day he gives me this, the, the tracking number, and yeah, it's on its way, and it, and it finally got it, and I got the box here, and here it is. Just giving you a real quick, brief update about the whole idea, okay? So let's get this box up. So what are we looking at now? We're looking at a device here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on. And I was really excited about it because uh, the, the possibilities of just interaction, just uh, uh, a couple of things. So this is how it is when it turns on, when you hit the power button, okay? And uh, let's go ahead and take a look at it. And by the way, there's, there's a screen, a see-through screen right in the middle, right here. And they do the black back, so it looks like a hologram, but it's actually just a piece of glass um, that eliminates uh, basically transparent glass LED should I call it or something like that um, and so it starts up like this the network is connected so that's the first thing it's going to tell you hey the network is connected um, I'm going to try to get this uh, out of this whole uh, thing here for so as you see right now um, this blonde person is basically in there um, you can see how you can see through like that okay and then in the top button here, you have to hit this one here in order to activate the other person. The volume's up and down. I don't know what this... If you press the right side, it gives you this dumb fish beta, like you're in a fish tank or something. I guess it's okay, but I wish I could change that to something else. And apparently, they said, you can't. You're stuck with this, and that's it. So, okay, so I'm going to go back now to this other one. Let's go ahead to... Uh, let's go back home, I guess. Let me see the volume. Let's go back. Oop. I guess I have to. Uh, it's it's hard to go back. Hi, I'm so Jenny. I'm going to go to the left button I'm now. I'm very happy to be with you. And when you hit the left button, it should activate the other person that actually talks to you. And as you notice, I'm having a lot of trouble with it. Um, it's really not even activating. Example, can you hear me? He won't respond whatsoever. So let's try this out again. So what I might have to do is turn it off, pack Hi, it on. Hi, I'm Jenny. I have to hit the left I'm side. I'm very happy to be with you. And there's a lot of bugs, you know, so I can't even get to that section. So I'm gonna have to turn it off, okay? I'm gonna have to turn it off. And I can't do the fish thing, because if I do, I have to shut it off turn it back on in order to get to the other person, the one that you're able to talk to. Um, and that's quite annoying, okay? So, let's go ahead and uh, let's get a little bit, see what happens here. All right, starting up, and it's displayed the name of the company that develops it. Um, a uh, hollow box is just the product name. And uh, let's see here. I'm, I'm sorry the video's a little bit long, but it literally is what I go through with this device. It's such a pain. I'm already four minutes, 50 seconds into the video. The network is connected. So now that I already connected it because I went through the phone app, and I'll show you my phone app, I have issues as well. So let's go to 
the other person. Hello, my friend. So as you notice, I have to start over to turn it on in order to get to this thing. Now, let me ask you a question. Now, what is today's date? Today's date is October 29th, 2021. What time is it where I'm located? I'm sorry, but I don't have access to your current location information. So you Please notice... check the time on your device or by using a world clock feature on your phone or computer. So as you notice a lot of information this person will not provide you locally. For example, what's the weather like in Las Vegas where I'm located? I'm sorry, but I don't have access to your current location information. You can find out the weather in Las Vegas by checking a reliable weather website or using a weather app on your device. Mm -hmm. As again, um, let me ask you another question. Uh, I don't even know. Um, do you even, my name Feel is- Feel free to ask any question you have and I'll do my best to provide you with a helpful answer. Right. Um, Tighten up your TV. If you have TV. any specific questions or and, need assistance and you with anything, that it does feel that. free it gets to in ask. The way of me asking. Do you know where Titan Outdoor TVs is located? I'm not able to browse the internet for real-time information, but you can try looking up Titan Outdoor TVs location on a search engine or a maps website. Can you connect to Bluetooth? I can't directly connect to Bluetooth as I'm a text-based AI but I can certainly help guide you through the process of connecting a device to Bluetooth. Can you play YouTube at all? No, I am not able to play YouTube videos. Can you play Pandora music? I can't play music, but I can help you find information about Pandora or other music streaming services. So, so here's what I don't know what the capability or the usage of this product is. I can't even ask it a lot of questions. And the fact that this image that I'm even displaying, um, she's actually quite scary looking, to be truthful. Like an almost a threatening look. Um, can you change the image of who you are? I'm just a text-based AI and don't have an image, but I'm here to help answer your questions. Can as you see, there's a lot of things that this device will not do. Um, so let's get into my phone. Um, I'm gonna show you the app of what it is here. Um, so here's the app. Um, it's the NS app, and I'm gonna move this out of the way so you can see it. So there's the NS app right here, okay? I'm gonna click on it. And you have to start up like this way. And I'm connected to the internet. I'm unable to view or interact with apps or images. And How can I assist you further? Here is down at the bottom and says uh, content. I'm going to hit content and I'm able to load up content if I can. Let me see if I can add a video, but I'm going to kind of move this out of the way screen. Let's make sure. Um, let's make sure it's uh, okay. I'm here to help with information and Let answer questions, here. but I'm unable to view or interact with specific apps or content if I click on it, device. it goes back out all if over again. If you have again. any questions or need assistance, feel free to ask. Let me go ahead and shut her off for a second. I'm going to go ahead and add content again. Unable to connect. Um, so I have to have her back on. Hi, I'm Jenny. It Let's seems like the try. connection is unable to add content at the moment. You may want to check your network connection and try again. But my connection is working because it says device or else it'll say offline if it wasn't connected. So let me try to add, refresh, nothing, add an image. I'm going to add my photo album, um, picture, and something went wrong with Hollabox. It's Hollabox possible that there may be an issue with the specific because this app has service a you were trying to use. It says, try, try updating the app, the app after device, developer provides a fix for this error. Support for further assistance. So... That is what you're getting every single time you want to update some, up, upload us. So, okay, so let's do this. Let's go back into the app again. And I'm gonna, because here's the device, I want to add the device. And what's gonna happen is gonna say, well. It sounds like you're trying to troubleshoot adding content to an and app. Nothing. But unfortunately, I can't directly interact with your device. I recommend checking the app support resources or contacting their customer service for assistance with adding content to the device. And this is, comes to my next 
to my next thing. And I'm going to go to Hollabox. How can I assist you with your Let's next go ahead. topic? I'm going to go ahead and shut her off. So here is all my emails, my text messages to this person. And lastly, I, I let them know all these things are going on. And uh, they were saying, um, oh, sorry about that. Who, who cares? It's not even worth anything. I cannot assist with that. Well, I was talking when he was on the floor. Um, I asked them about music. They said music is played through I'm the video. Sorry. I'm not sure what you mean. Um, Hi, can you I'm please Jackie. provide me more ahead. context or clarify I'm very your happy request? Now I got two people talking at once over there. Okay. I asked, uh, also, I see that uh, um, if I could change a the person, they said, no, you can't do it yourself. This is a digital human, that only they can do it. I said, it can't log in my Pandora phone or app. Sorry, it cannot. Um, they asked what I was using. I, I sent everything I was doing. Um, there's a lot of interaction at first, but then he disappeared. Like, that's it. I, I haven't heard from him since for a week already. And that's the problem I'm having with this thing. This device, in my opinion, is the most useless device you can pretty much get on the market. It literally is the most useless device. There is no reason for this. There is no uh, helping for it. The videos that are shown on YouTube that display that it shows all these dancing people and, and how you can react and tell me the latest movie. It doesn't have a clue of your location in order to even ask that question. So it, it literally doesn't do it. Now, I've told it my name is Mike. And it remembered at first, but if I turn it off, it has no clue. It doesn't remember. So the device has zero memory, basically, and has no capability. My cell phone is a thousand times better at talking to um, and asking questions uh, and, and just talking better interaction than this device. This device, if I have to say, is one of the most useless, most idiotic, most just disturbing, money-ripping-off device. This thing should not be sold for the price that it was, but should be sold for like $20. It is that useless. It's it's, it's a gimmick that should be thrown away in the garbage. Um, there's support, you will get zero support from these people. The company literally has no clue what they're doing. Um, it just, it's a, it's a novelty is what it is. You know what? I'd be happy if I could just get video images of jellyfish and just pretend let it be a goldfish, I guess. I guess the goldfish part is probably the only real, um, I guess now thinking about it, the goldfish is probably the only, uh, a beta fish is the only useful thing for it because at least it looks like a little, little fish aquarium, I guess, you know? I'd rather have the dancing woman in there that looks kind of cool or, or some other image um, or be able to load up images of people on there, but it just doesn't do that. And uh, to give you an idea what I'm just talking about, I mean, I guess really I don't really have to need to ask a question because it's not going to have to answer to anything I ask it anyways. And go the ahead. network is connected. I'm just going to go ahead, just leave it like a fish because that's literally what I got. A $200 image fish. That's what I paid for. Yeah. Boy, we, we, we really believe in, in technology and just get this is the best technology. When you buy this product is what you're going to get. So that's my, that's my opinion. I mean, it, it's had nothing to do with the company. I don't know anybody there. They don't know me. And um, this is my true opinion, what I experienced, and it's just a worthless piece of technology, goldfish, beta fish, whatever, aquarium. Not even that good either. It kind of sucks, actually. Anyhow, that's it. Bye.